The Berkeley Open Infrastructure for Network Computing Boink, pronounced, rhymes with oink". An open source middleware system, supports volunteer and grid computing. Originally developed to support the SETI at Home project, it became generalized as a platform for other distributed applications in areas as diverse as mathematics, linguistics, medicine, molecular biology, climatology, environmental science, and astrophysics, among others. Boink aims to enable researchers to tap into the enormous processing resources of multiple personal computers around the world. Boink development originated with a team based at the Space Sciences Laboratory SSL at the University of California, Berkeley and led by David Anderson, who also leads SETI at home. As a high-performance distributed computing platform, Boink brings together about 311,742 active participants and 834,343 active computers hosts worldwide processing on average 26.431 petaflops as of 9 June 2018. It would be the fourth largest processing capability in the world compared with an individual supercomputer supercomputer TOP500 list. The National Science Foundation NSF funds Boink through awards SI 0221529, SI 0438443 and SI 0721124. Guinness World Records ranks Boink as the largest computing grid in the world. Boink code runs on various operating systems, including Microsoft Windows, Mac OS, Android, Linux, and FreeBSD. Boink is free software released under the terms of the new Lesser General Public License (LGPL). Topic History. Boink was originally developed to manage the SETI at Home project. The original SETI client was a non-Boink software exclusively for SETI at Home. As one of the first volunteer grid computing projects, it was not designed with a high level of security. As a result, some participants in the project attempted to cheat the project to gain credits, while some others submitted entirely falsified work. Boink was designed, in part, to combat these security breaches. The Boink project started in February 2002, and the first version was released on April 10, 2002. The first Boink-based project was Predictor at Home launched on June 9, 2004. In 2009, Aqua at Home deployed multi-threaded CPU applications for the first time, followed by the first OpenCL application in 2010. As of 2 January 2018, 37 Boink projects are active. Topic: Design and structure. In essence, Boink is software that can use the unused CPU and GPU cycles on a computer to do scientific computing. What one individual does not use of his/her computer, Boink uses. In late 2008, BOINC's official website announced that NVIDIA had developed a system called CUDA that uses GPUs for scientific computing. With NVIDIA's assistance, some Boink-based projects e.g., SETI at Home, Milky Way at Home now have applications that run on NVIDIA GPUs using CUDA. Beginning in October 2009, Boink added support for the RT.AMD family of GPUs also. 
these applications run from 2 to 10 times faster than the former CPU-only versions. In 7x preview versions, GPU support via OpenCL was added for computers using Mac OS X with AMD Radeon graphic cards. Boink consists of a server system and client software that communicate with each other to distribute and process work units and return the results. Topic: User interfaces. Boink can be controlled remotely by remote procedure calls (RPC) from the command line and from the Boink account manager. Boink manager currently has two views: the advanced view and the simplified GUI. The grid view was removed in the 6.6.x clients as it was redundant. The appearance skin of the simplified GUI is user-customizable, in that users can create their own designs. <laughs> <laughs> Mobile application A Boink app also exists for Android, allowing every person owning an Android device, smartphone, tablet and Kindle, to share their unused computing power. The user is allowed to select the research projects they want to support, if it is in the app's available project list. By default, the application will allow computing only when the device is connected to a Wi-Fi network, is being charged, and the battery has a charge of at least 90%. Only some of the Boink projects are available, including Asteroids at Home, Collatz Conjecture, Einstein at Home, Enigma at Home, LHC at Home, Mu. Rapper, Quake Catcher Network, Rosetta at Home, SETI at Home, The Skynet POGS, Universe at Home, World Community Grid and YoYo at Home. Account managers A Boink account manager is an application that manages multiple Boink project accounts across multiple computers CPUs and operating systems. Account managers were designed for people who are new to Boink or have several computers participating in several projects. The account manager concept was conceived and developed jointly by GridRepublic and Boink. Current account managers include BAM – Boink Account Manager the first publicly available account manager, released for public use on May 30, 2006 GridRepublic – follows the idea of keeping it simple and keep it neat when it comes to account management Charity Engine Nonprofit Account Manager for Hire uses prize draws and continuous charity fundraising to motivate people to join the grid. Dazzler Open Source Account Manager to ease institutional management resources. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Credit System The Boink credit system is designed to avoid cheating by validating results before granting credit. A credit management system helps to ensure that users are returning results which are both scientifically and statistically accurate. Online distributed computing is almost entirely a volunteer endeavor. For this reason, projects are dependent on a complicated and variable mix of new users, long-term users, and retiring users. Topic: Projects. 
There are about 35 projects currently listed, of which about half yield published reports. The licensing of the projects varies. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Gridcoin Since 2013, the cryptocurrency Gridcoin has been associated with Boink as a remunerative coin. Gridcoin uses a modified proof-of-stake timestamping system called Proof of Research to reward participants for computational work completed on Boink. The Proof of Research system was implemented on October 11, 2014. The system takes into account a parameter supplied with the limited number of whitelisted projects called RAC recent average credit, and distributes the coin according to the proportion of RAC acquired in the project to the people who are computing in it. Each whitelisted project gets the same amount of GRC to distribute among its contributors. Topic. See also Boink Client Server Technology BOSA Citizen Cyberscience Center Great Internet Merson Prime Search Grid.org Gridcoin List of distributed computing projects Distributed Net